Hey everyone, Big Jack here and welcome to my 100% walkthrough for Kid Gohan's Dragon Universe or Story Mode um, in Dragon Ball Z Budokai 3. Uh, this is a 100% walkthrough of Kid Gohan's uh, first playthrough on the Story Mode because after completing the Story Mode once for a certain character, um, you get bonus bosses and new items in like every playthrough after it, you know. Um, so yeah, this is a 100% through... Uh, 100% walkthrough for the first playthrough um, and I am playing on normal mode because I'm level 0 and any higher of the difficulty I can't speak and um, it'd be really difficult so yeah um, you can do any uh, difficulty you want I'll just showcase it on uh, normal mode because this walkthrough isn't so much about the fights themselves rather it is about showing you all the events and items you can get uh, in the playthrough so yeah let's start this thing Okay, Kid Gohan is uh, who we're playing as. Long, long ago, Goku had many adventures while searching for the seven magic Dragon Balls. With his trusted friends by his side, Goku successfully battled many powerful foes until... The Earth was attacked by a mysterious warrior race, and so, a new battle begins. What is it? Ah, there's a huge power level over there. So, for Kid Go On, we start with nothing. Not even a death move. Um, so the first battle with Piccolo is quite difficult. <laughs> oh well, uh, I'm sure we'll manage. Okay, so the first thing we are going to focus on is the four Dragon Balls in the Saiyan Saga. So, um, the first thing we're going to want to do is get the Dragon Radar, which is up here. That make finding the Dragon Balls a lot easier. So, if you're wondering where I am when I get these events, uh, just look at the mini-map and you can see exactly where I am. Ah, the Dragon Radar. Alright. Doesn't seem like something you want to leave around, you know? Okay, so let's get to finding the four Dragon Balls. So, uh, the first one is up here by the North City. Uh, check the Dragon Radar and it is right here. So, if you check the minimap, that is where it is. Hehehe, <laughs> I found a Dragon Ball. The Seven Star Dragon Ball, wow. Okay, so the next one is down here in the desert area. Check the radar. Here it is. Hehehe, <laughs> I found a Dragon Ball. Ooh, the one star. I go from the highest to the lowest. Okay, so the, uh, the next Dragon Ball is over to the west here. In the forest. Hey, 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 I found a Dragon Ball. <laughs> the six-star Dragon Ball. I wonder if I'll get a two-star Dragon Ball next. The next Dragon Ball is just south of the World Tournament. Uh, down here. Well, let me just get the map out. Hey, 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 I found a Dragon Ball. A four-star. Ah, I got uh, Grandpa Gohan's. Okay, so that is all the um, Dragon Balls. Now we're going to be starting Story Events 1, because there are multiple Story Events, but this is just the first section. So yeah, what we're going to do is we're going to head to the red marker here, the red dot on the map. I just call them red markers. Uh, by the way, if you see anything like uh, the question marks, leave them, um, unless you want to get them, but I get them in their own part, so... Yeah, I will come back to get that, but let's just focus on the story events right now. You know about the Dragon Balls, yes? Goku's friends will use them to wish him back. But the Saiyans who will come a year from now are supposed to be even stronger. If that's true, Goku and I won't be able to defeat them alone. We need your help. Huh? Me? No! I can't fight! You don't know it yet. But there was a great power sleeping within you. 
You're lying. I don't have any power. Do you want proof? Hey, what are you doing? Ouch! Stop it! I... I did that? That's right. Now, do you understand? Okay, so back up from the red marker on the map here yeah, and turn to the left and you will see another event here. Yeah. Um, I'll show you now, actually, with the key finding thing. So that right there is the red marker. Look to the left and you will see this one. Go to this one. I hope you're ready, Gohan. I won't hold back this time. Wow, Piccolo's serious. I better watch it. If you can't last one minute against me, you wouldn't survive against the Saiyans. So if you want to stay alive, come at me with everything you've got. Okay, Piccolo, I won't let you down. Whoa! Yeah, no, Piccolo, I got it. I, I don't know the context of this. Uh, speech bubble, so I don't know how to express it. Not that I would do a good job, anyway. So we have a new capsule, and it is... The Fruit of Training uh, capsule, which boosts your power attack. So yeah, awesome. So we're gonna head... Uh, you can equip the uh, capsules if you want. Um, I'll just stay I'll just stay vanilla, I will. Um, so head forward a little bit. And use the uh, key search, you know, the chi search, you know, mechanic. And there are two um, events here, both labeled mountains. I'm going to go to the right one first. Although you can go to any one you want. First. <laughs> I want to be strong like Dad and Piccolo. I want to save the earth. Foolish kid. Hey, these are just like your clothes, Piccolo. So we got a new capsule. And this capsule you get for this event is a randomized um is a randomized tribe uniform capsule. So you could get the normal tribe uniform or the evil mystery uniform or yeah, it's you get you just get a random tribe uniform. So let's go to the other event over here. Wow, S somebody help! Huh? Wh where am I? I'm scared. Hmm? Ah, a capsule! How lucky! You rotten brat! Don't cause me any more trouble! A capsule! Um, this capsule you get here is a randomized item capsule. I bet my freaking... But, uh, like, you know, never mind. <laughs> okay, so after this, we are going to go to the battle point. Uh, because there is a fight to do here. It's a pretty difficult fight because um, uh, we don't have any death moves. So we have to rely on physical attacks and stuff. So uh, here is the battle point if you check the map. So let's get started with the battle with Piccolo. Head up, huh? Sounds like fun. Come on, bring it. I should mention, Piccolo has two uh, uh, death moves. He has Destructive Wave, which is a uh, long-range death move uh, or super attack. And he also has Special Beam Cannon, um, which is bad. I do not want Piccolo to put me into a Dragon Rush situation. Um, because he can only use Special Beam Cannon at the end of a successful Dragon Rush. So, yeah. <laughs> Let's get started. Oh, I wanted to grab. Oh, well. What the? I didn't even know he done that. Huh? Oh, man. A mid combo as well. Oh, my gosh. Let's see if I can... Uh... Yeah, I had a feeling he was going to do X. I think Piccolo always starts with X or Y. Um, which is good. I took some damage off him, too. 
Right, let's get him now while his key is low. Damn it, how can he attack faster than me? What the hell? I love Piccolo's fighting style, it's so cool. Damn it, that was sneaky. Whoa, man. Oh, man, that was nice. How is he not uh, getting knocked off? Like, the stage has that, you know? Wanted to grab them, but oh well. Yep. Bow! Nice, had some armor. Not good. No, don't walk towards him. Freaking camera messing me up. Yeah, let's do it. Bow! Okay, Piccolo figured me out. Damn you, Piccolo! Right, let's go get him. Oh, damn it. I'm gonna do my secret combo. <laughs> Okay, what have we got? A level up. Um, I will show you all the... Um, okay, so le let me just go through the stats quickly here. So health obviously puts up your health bar. How much health you start with. Chi is okay. I'm just going to say chi. Uh, the higher you put up in chi, the, least, the less chi you use when you use like teleporting, super attacks. It pretty much affects your overall chi consumption. Um, or usage. Attack, um, when you put that up, it puts up physical attacks. Guard, uh, the higher your guard start, the le less damage you take when you actually guard. Um, arts is, um, death move damage, super attack damage. Um, ability is how good the, uh, your equipped items are. Uh, like healing items and stuff. And calm, uh, that's pretty much useless. The higher this, the higher the calm, uh, uh, start the better the AI will fight when you fight it by putting in the password. I'm just gonna focus on health and attack. See when you put in this password, I don't exactly know where. I think it's in the Dragon Arena. Um, you can fight the com of your own story mode character. So yeah. Okay, after the battle point battle, it is time to start story events two. So, um, what we're going to do, we're going to make our way to the East City, which is up here. Huh? Why is he hiding? Uh... Hey, it's a kid. Oh, well. Today's the day. Where are all the pretty young girls? Gohan? Uh-oh. Not good. Huh? What's this? We got a capsule. And this is a random equipment capsule. A random equipment capsule. <laughs> I can't say it properly. After that, the next place we're going to go to is the World Tournament uh, area. So I'm just going to do a shortcut by heading north and then turn in here. So here's the World Tournament. Here, huh? This is where Dad and Mr. Piccolo fought. Dad and Mr. Piccolo's fight must have been more incredible than I can imagine. I have to train too, and become as strong as Dad and Mr. Piccolo. After the World Tournament uh, event, we are going to head to Baba's Palace, which is over in the desert here. Your Goku-san, long time no see. Uh, uh, hello. You shouldn't go out on the night of a full moon. This place gives me the creeps. I hear that. <laughs> the next place we're gonna head to is the South City. So just over here. There we go. Hello, Yajirobi. Hey, Goku's kid. You're getting big. Looking strong there. What are you doing? Shopping? Yeah, you know me. Corrin's little errand boy. Man, that cat wears me out. Oh well, I better get back so he can yell at me some more. Sheesh. 
So after that event, um, head back over to the desert and in the mountain area of the desert, um, I'll use the chi uh, finding mechanic and uh, head to uh, these mountains. I'll actually show you on the mini map where it is. So let's go to it. Yo, help! Hey, are you guys playing chess? Looks like fun. Does it look like I'm having fun? This isn't a game. Are you sure? Because if it is, I'll, I'll be cheating if I help you. No, it's not. I swear it's not. So help me now. Okay, Yajirobi. <sighs> well, sure it took you long enough. Oh well, better late than ever, I guess. Here, this for you. We finally got... Masenko! Oh my gosh, I'm so happy. Now we can actually do some damage in battles. Okay, so let's equip the um, Masenko capsule. Okay, so now that we've done the story events, uh, story events 2, I'm pretty sure, um, it is time to start side quests 1. So uh, we got some side quests to do. So uh, let's uh, start with this one over here. Um, there's a sparkle right here. Oh, someone dropped this. I better give it to a policeman. Um, what was that? 5,000 Zenny. Okay. Uh, so the next one is um, on the uh, snowy island area where the muscle tower is. Uh, and here it is. Oh, someone dropped this. I better give it to a policeman. Another 5,000 Zenny. So, we're going to be heading over here now to the uh, west of where we was. Because there's a rather interesting capsule here. Huh, what's that? I wonder if it will come in handy. A grey capsule. Uh, so, this is a silver membership card. This is interesting in that, um, depending on what your character's level is, um, will determine what membership card show up so from level z uh, 0 to 20 you get a silver membership card from level 20 i think it's 20 or 21 to 30 you get the gold membership card and from level 30 or 31 to onwards you get the black membership card um if you're like level 30, you get the black membership card and then you can go back to the event to get the gold one and redo the event for the silver one instantly after, you know, exiting out to the screen like I'm going to do now. Okay, so there is some money down um, uh, this area here. Ah, here it is. The last of the side quests. For now, anyway. Oh, someone dropped this. I better give it to a policeman. Another 5,000 zenny. Nice. Okay. So now that the side quests are done, we are going to um, go to the red marker to um, uh, fight Piccolo. And it, it should be easier now since we got Masenko. So yeah, let's fight Piccolo. Listen up. If you want to save the earth, you have to get stronger than those Saiyans. Yes. Okay, so again, Piccolo has Destructive Wave and Special Beam Cannon, so be careful. Bring on, Piccolo. Yeah, I love using death moves. <laughs> okay, let's see what he does. Okay, some vanishing. Oh, man, I hate that attack. It's so sketchy. The way it's like a slow start up. Okay. Nice. Got the throw. Oh no. Damn it. Okay. Damn it. You and your teleporting. Nice. And he hit the wall too. Look at this tr guy trying to grab me. How do you tech that? That's what I want now. Oh, nice. He shouldn't have jumped back. 
Okay, nice. Kick into the wall. Okay, let's see what we get. Two levels. Nice. So again, I'm gonna put I'm just gonna keep leveling health and attack. Mr. Piccolo, my dad told me that you're not nearly as evil as the old Piccolo. He said you're turning into a good guy. I think he's right. You little brat. It's almost been a year now. I have to get stronger. Huh. Two huge power levels. The Saiyans must be here. Okay, so now we are going to do the battle point. Uh, because there is a new fighter there. So let's head there. It's just northwest of uh, your home. Or Goku's house, I suppose. I suppose northwest, yeah. Uh, more west than northwest, but whatever. So let's start the battle point fight. Here goes. So Krillin has two death moves, and that's the Kamehameha, Kamehameha, <laughs> and Destructor Disc. They're both long-range attacks, so be careful. Okay, bring it. Nice, nice. I have no key. Yeah, I should have. I should have. Damn it! I should have uh, gone on the defense a little bit and charged my key, but I rushed. Okay, that's not what I want to do. <laughs> I wanna. Damn it! I knew he was going to teleport then. Wow, look at that! Twelve hit combo. Well, eleven hit combo. Okay, we're messing Krillin up here. Completely messing him up. Damn it, I'm too far away. Oh, that was nice, then, Krillin. I, I admit that was nice. Damn it, hit confirms, uh, Bayjax. Hit, hit confirms. Ooh, not good. A bit spammy, then, but oh well. <laughs> okay, do we level up? Yeah, we do. Nice. Okay. Okay, so after the battle point fight, we're going to be starting story events three. So um, turn around and head to the uh, mountain here because there's a uh, small event here. I'll just use the chief finding uh, mechanic. Wow, Wolf Fang Fist! I sense an incredible power. I better not get in the way of his training. I don't know what to call that mechanic. Chi, chi search, I suppose. Um, so after that, we're going to head to the Kame house here. Hello. Gohan, I'm so sorry, son. If only I had more power, you'd still be alive. Uh, I am still alive. Oh. Well, after Piccolo took you away, I thought you were a ghost. What a relief. You foolish man. So uh, we're going to head up to the forest here now. Uh, for an event. So I'm going to key search. Is it further north? I'm sure it is. Or is it behind me? Ah, yes, behind me. So I'll have a look at the minimap. That's where I am. Let's go. Oh, this stinks! My bike's broken! I'm stuck in this place! I can't find TN! Uh, miss, this place isn't safe. Yeah? Well, if it's so dangerous, what are you doing here, kid? Oh my. Not good. Hey, what was that noise? A dinosaur? <gasps> I'm getting out of here! Okay, so that is all the story events done now. So now we're going to start side quest 2. And there's only one side quest in this section. And that is West City, which is over here. Uh, right here. Gohan, wow, you look really different. Uh, 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 do I? Uh, here, I just happened to get this. So take it. Take good care of it. So we got a new capsule. And this is a random equipment capsule. So cool. 
Okay, so after that now, we are going to start the um, story uh, story mission. So let's head over to the uh, red marker here. Don't know why I'm going slow, I just am. <laughs> Ugh. What's going on? It's the middle of the day. Why did it get so dark? It's Shenron. Goku's being wished back to life. Okay, so again, we're gonna head to the red marker here. Why you? I'll take on all of you goons at once! Wow, amazing! <laughs> Thank you, Piccolo. Stay focused, Gohan. Don't make yourself an easy target. Next time, you better be prepared to save yourself. Okay, so the Cybermen have two attacks. They have Acid. And they have self-destruct. Acid is a long-range attack. Self-destruct, the a counter will appear on their head. And then they will chase you down and try and grapple you and uh, blow up. It takes off one bar of health, so be careful. So uh, let's fight the Cyberman. Damn you. I hate you. So that was Acid. Very, uh, very strong, actually. Damn it. Oh, wow, he's kicking my butt, yeah? I will get my revenge. Nice. Okay, yeah. Keep the combo going. Oh, that was nice. Nice throw there. Just a quick combo there. I'm staying away from the wall. Because the camera goes all weird. Nice. Although all my keys gone now. I achieved. What are you gonna do, Cyberman? Cyberman? Damn it, you and your teleport then. And that four hit combo. Damn it! <laughs> okay. Nice. Ooh, we block. Nice. KO! Okay, do we level up? Yes! We are stronger in attack now. I still can't sense Dad's power. Please come quickly, Dad. What's the matter, Gohan? Don't worry over nothing. Goku will get you for sure. R right. This Goku you speak of, surely you don't mean Kakarot. That's right, so what? He couldn't even defeat Raditz, so what's the use? He's a lot stronger than before, he can beat you. Okay, I'll wait a bit longer. Okay, now we are going to go back to the battle point because the uh, opponent has changed. So let's head up there. Uh, right here, the opponent is two Cybermen you gotta battle. Very easy, so uh, let's take them out. <laughs> so again, they have Acid and Self Destruct, so be a bit careful about that, especially if you're on low health. So uh, let's go. Quick combo, nice. Oh, what the hell? I wanted to grab him then. Oh, what the hell? I feel like... I, I feel like I should have freaking... <laughs> I feel like I should have... Uh, uh, grabbed him then. What the hell, man? Ugh. Right to the end of my combo too. Straight type of order. I'll join you because I am... Uh, I shouldn't have done that because I might have to block some of his attacks. And I'm going to lose Chi. Uh... Okay, never mind. 
Yeah. Oh, what the hell? Maybe I couldn't go into a Dragon Rage or Dragon Rush mode because I ran out of key right at the Masenko, but that's annoying. Damn you. Ooh, I almost done footsies then, but uh, I went back into his uh, kick. Oh well, he's done. Okay, did we level up? We didn't. Ah. Okay, uh, now we are going to do the uh, final battle of the Saiyan Saga, which is Nappa, the red marker. Um, so, uh, if you have not unlocked it yet, um, you can get a story reenacted. Um, you know, how can I explain it? You know the story reenactments in the bonus section of the Dragon Universe uh, part of the game, uh, the menu. Um, to get the story reenacted for this battle, you have to use Masenko as Gohan. Either use it or hit it. I would say hit Nappa with a Masenko. Always hit it. Um, I'd save you, by the way, because if you don't manage to hit a Masenko in battle, then you can just reload. So yeah, save now and hit Nappa with a Masenko. Um, okay, so let's get into it and finish the Saiyan Saga. Okay, so Nappa has two uh, death moves. That is Bomber DX and Break Cannon. Uh, I don't remember if Break Cannon is a long-range attack. I think it is, though. And Bomber DX is a long-range attack. And Nappa uh, has an ultimate attack, which is Giant Storm. So be very careful about Nappa when he's in uh, hyper mode. Because you don't want to get hit by an ultimate. Uh, remember, everyone, use a Masenko. Hit Nappa with a Masenko. Um, so let's go. Okay, there we go. Okay, that sucked. What the hell, man? Completely j kicked over me then. Who is this guy, huh? Who do you think he's hit then, huh? Camera's gone weird. This isn't Shin Budokai. Cut it out with that camera. Haha. <laughs> Wait a minute, did he just teleport into my Masenko? <laughs> I think he did, when I teleported behind him. I've always found that weird, the whole teleporting. Shouldn't it be, like, moving really fast? Because isn't instant transmission teleporting? Like, I'm pretty sure any fighter cannot just teleport mid-battle. I'm pretty sure instant transmission is the only uh, uh, teleporting move, you know? Okay... Damn it, you and your teleporting. Okay. Nice. Oh, what the hell? Okay, good. Gonna do my combo. Well, I was going to, but never mind. That one when I just punch all the time. <laughs> oh, boy. Not good. Nappa, you should probably stop using that attack, because <laughs> you're just jumping straight over me. Damn it! I'm so slow with the um, uh, teleport in, but he's done. Okay, definitely a level up, yeah? Two level ups, nice. Awesome! Okay, so here is the story reenacted. Kid Gohan vs. Nappa. Conditions activate spe specialty skill Masenko. Um, and we have voice data number three for that. So let's start the Freezer saga, I think. Okay. Brat, that's enough. After this cutscene, I suppose. <laughs> A 
Having successfully fended off the Saiyan onslaught, Goku opts to spare Vegeta's life. Mark my words, you'll pay for this, Kakarot! You and all of your friends! Krillin, Gohan, and Bulma travel to Namek in the hopes of reviving their fallen friend. Once there, they confront the evil Frieza, who is also searching for the Dragon Balls. Helpless against Frieza's might, they have no choice but to join forces with Vegeta. Meanwhile, Goku has healed and is headed for Namek in a ship built by Bulma's father. His efforts to recover the Dragon Balls frustrated, Frieza summons the Ginyu Force. Can young Gohan survive against the Ginyu Force and Frieza? Will Goku make it in time? Wait, I'll check the atmosphere. Hopefully there's oxygen. Hey, what are you doing out here before I say it's okay? Use your heads. <sighs> Well, we might as well start looking for the Dragon Balls. Hey, look, I'm already getting a signal. So they really do exist. Grillin, I'm sensing a lot of strong power levels. It's probably just the Namekians. I mean, Kami and Piccolo were strong too. By the way, look at the word Namekians. It's spelled wrong. <laughs> they put the A before the I. <laughs> There's some huge power levels over there. Feels like trouble. We better go check it out. Okay, so um, uh, we're gonna be looking for the Dragon Balls first. The Dragon Balls will be the first thing we do. Um, even though we got a Dragon Raider from the Saiyan Saga, I am gonna show you where the Dragon Raider is in the uh, Namek Saga or Freezer Saga, just because. So um, the uh, Dragon Raider is right behind us. <laughs> Ah, the Dragon Raider. All right, now I got two. <laughs> okay, so uh, the um, fifth Dragon Ball and sixth actually are both up here. So is that it? Yes, it is. Let me show you on the mini map. There we go. Hey, hey, hey! I found a Dragon Ball. The two-star Dragon Ball. Two-star. And the uh, sixth Dragon Ball is just north of it. Right here. Hehehehe, <laughs> I found a Dragon Ball. <laughs> Three star. So the final one we get will be a five star Dragon Ball. And the fifth star Dragon Ball is on this island over here. Um, here it is. <laughs> I found all the Dragon Balls. The five star. Okay, people, now we are going to be doing the battle point. So, um, let's go to it. And it is up here. Um, right here. So, we're going to be fighting two Cybermen. Again, they have acid and self-destruct. So, you should be used to fighting these things by now. How dare you say that about my mother? You will die this day. Okay, or not. <laughs> what the hell, man? Let me hit you. Oh, what the hell, man? I freaking... I'm pressing buttons. It's giving me time. Like, it freezes the screen. I should have time to... Uh... Okay, watch this footsies now. Okay, <laughs> never mind. Yep. Yo. Yeah! I need to practice that more often. Um, whenever they charge up an attack, just quickly hit the uh, whatever, the LT or RT or whatever. <laughs> whatever the heavy smash button is. Or whatever the attack is called. Guard crash or whatever. I need to uh, do that more rather than dodge in. Because it looks cool. Okay, I was a bit slow then, but whatever. Okay, I can uh, interrupt that. Nice. 
Okay, good, good, good. Nice, very good. Osu! Yosh! Um, no level up. Okay, people, now we are going to be doing story events. One. And you know what you do here? You just go to every single red marker. <laughs> just go to all the red dots until we do the next fight, which is Rikum. So, uh, let's go. Stop it! Leave him alone, you big bully! Come on, Gohan! We've gotta move! <laughs> Okay, on to the next one. Oh, by the way, uh, when you uh, fly near that first red marker, um, you automatically go into the Namek village. Someone's coming this way, and fast! Quick, hide! This isn't a very good hiding place. We just have to cross our fingers and hope we get lucky. Kr Krillin, is that...? Yes, it's me, Vegeta. What? He can sense power levels? Not good. Even if we suppress our energy, he could still sense the kid here. He's here! I am Vegeta! Whew, that was close. I thought we were done for. On to the next marker, which is straight ahead. Krillin, you feel that? What's wrong, you guys? Is someone coming? The Namekians! Another village is being attacked! And I know who's doing it. I'd recognize that power level anywhere. It's Vegeta! Let's go to the Namek village. The Red Marker. Oh no, the entire village has been wiped out. Vegeta, that monster! To the next red marker. I'm got I'm saying that a lot now. Your hidden powers are incredible, like I've never sensed before. Excuse me, but could you hurry? <laughs> ah, I really did have hidden powers. Thank you, Mr. Guru. Okay, we have a red capsule and it is. The Unlock Potential Capsule. This is a new transformation for Kid Gohan. So equip the Unlock Potential um, uh, transformation if you want. Um, so let's head to the next red marker here. Someone's headed right for me and they've got a huge power level. Vegeta! I've got to hide my energy. I know you're here somewhere. Show yourself, or I'll destroy this entire area. I'm warning you, I won't say it again. God, I love uh, Namek, uh, Namek Saga Vegeta. <laughs> Wait, I'm here. You, I should have known. I just ran into your little friends. Ah, you monster! What did you do? You better not have hurt them. No, my wish for immortality is about to be granted, so I'm in a good mood. <laughs> okay, let's head to the next red marker, which is up in the south, uh, I mean northeast of the map, as you can see. And they're coming this way. It can't be. Freeze's god, the Ginyu Force. You have to let me use the Dragon Balls. It's the only way we'll survive. Do this now, and I promise never to harm you or your friends. Okay. 
I guess I have no choice but to trust you. Man, I love Vegeta. Like I said, I love Vegeta's Namek Saga version of him. Just Vegeta's whole mission on uh, Planet Namek was so cool. <laughs> like on his own and then having to team up with, um, you know, uh, Krillin and go on and then. Oh, it's just so cool. Vegeta's part of it was so fun. It makes me want to watch through it again. I think I might actually. Anyway, let's go to the red marker, which is in the same spot. Huh? Are these Dragon Balls? Ha ha! They're all your Freezer will be most pleased. No, I was so close. I'll take the Dragon Balls back to Freezer. The rest of you can decide what to do with these pests. D do you think we should make a run for it? Oh, yeah, Riku has such a dumb voice. Grr, I get Vegeta. Yeah, and you realize why I'm talking like that now. Ha <laughs> ha, we're gonna fight Riku. Oh, after this, I suppose. If Vegeta goes down, then we'll be next for sure. We won't stand a chance. We gotta do something, Gohan. Let's go. Uh, uh, right. Riku, me raise a gun. So I thought you'd get me with a sneak attack, huh? I'd give him a list, man. Well, you did it. You got me mad. I sound like Big the Cat of Sonic the Hedgehog. What the hell? Krillin! Krillin! Oh, man. I think he just broke every bone in my body. He's too, he's too strong for... Okay, Krillin don't sound like this. What the hell? He's too strong for us. Have to try to stop him. All right, kid. I guess I can play with you for a while. Jeez, I was way off. All right, kid. I guess I can play with. Oh, okay, whatever. Okay, so Riku actually has four. Um, uh, he has two death moves and um, two like I how can I explain like miscellaneous moves, I suppose. Um, so he has the Riku kick, which is a charge in death move. Uh, like a melee charge uh, move. He has the Rikum Eraser Gun, which is a long range attack. I suppose the Rikum Kick could be a long distance and like a long range and short range. You you know what I mean if you know Rikum's attacks. He has the Special Fight Impulse 3 and the Special Fight Impulse 4. I actually don't know what they do. I'm sure they um, they uh, buff his stats. Um, and Rikum also has a ultimate, which is the Rikum Bomber. So be careful about Rikum when he's in hyper mode. So let's uh, destroy this thing. <laughs> this guy. Okay, he's going to teleport. They always do that. When, you, when you're hitting them and they're up in the air being juggled, they almost always teleport after the third hit. At least the... Um, uh, I, sp I think all difficulties do. Oh, damn it. Okay, since I uh, have enough, I'm going to transform. Yeah. Look at my aura. Look how fast it's like. That's awesome. Bow. Oh, you do well. Okay, good. I managed to... Uh... Oh, oh, I should have done the thing. Nice try, Riku. <laughs> I'm going to just... Look at the way he charges. That's so weird. See, that's a Riku kick. Very dangerous because uh, it's unblockable too. Um... So that sucks. What the hell? Nice. Oh, I tried to teleport. Okay. Oh, I should have done the thing. Man, my timing is so off. Oh, man. Yeah, I'm kind of like... Damn, son. I'm already got the same health as him now. Okay, nice. Damn it, man. Why can I not teleport when... <sighs> not good. I can't teleport when he teleports behind me. It must be because I'm mid super. No, you can't teleport mid super attack. Okay, nice. Thank goodness. What the hell? I thought I was pressing up then. Okay, nice. This is a close fight. Damn it. Oh, thank goodness. And he's uh, conf uh, not confused. <laughs> uh, fatigued. That was tough. 
Okay, 5,000. Wow, we leveled up three times, baby. Awesome. My dad wouldn't give up now, and neither will I. I won't let you win. <laughs> I don't think you have much choice. Okay, so we got a great capsule now. Which is the Planet Namek stage. Which is nice. You can all unlock this with other characters as well. But yeah, we got it now. <laughs> I think the battle against that Ginyu guy must be over. Looks like Dad won. Okay, so now we are going to do side quest one. And there's only one side quest <laughs> in the saga. There's like nothing in the saga apart from story stuff. So um, we're going to head down to... Um, uh, this south area. Oh, ah, here it is, right here. What's the matter, Gohan? Are you hungry? Uh, <laughs> Just a second. Here you are. Thank you. This is a random item capsule. And she made us chicken and egg bowl, which is nice. Okay, after that battle, we are going to head up to the red marker because we just got story stuff to do now. Did I just say that battle? I mean that uh, event. <laughs> that Bulma event. I wish Bulma was a uh, playable character to fight with. I feel like she'd have some funny moves. Anyway, um, yeah, let's just do all the story stuff now and finish Gohan's uh, Kid Gohan story. Oh, that music's so good. Ah, uh, Freezer's getting more powerful by the minute. And Dad's hurt. It's up to me now. I have to stop him. Okay. Ow. I hit my hand on my desk. Uh, over here. My dreams of immortality ruined. All thanks to you. You're the first ones to ever make a complete fool of me like this. And you will be the last. You are going to pay dearly for what you've done. Yes, if I team up with them, we can win. <laughs> You're only deluding yourself. It's time to put an end to your lunatic fantasy. Transform, Frieza. Why don't you show us who you really are? Why not? Since you're in such a hurry to die. Man, I love Vegeta. He's so awesome. <laughs> he's, he's definitely probably my joint favorite character with Piccolo. He's so cool, man. So sorry to keep you waiting. Now then, it's time for round two. Such a freaky transformation, man. It does look cool, though. Anyway, um, this is the final battle in Gohan's Kid Gohan's uh, first playthrough or second. But there's like a bonus. There's like a special last boss. Um, with uh, anyway, this is the last boss for now. Um, okay, so this uh, freezer, this third form freezer, has two. Uh, death moves, which is Death Beam and Death Death Wave, and they are both um, long-ranged attacks. And um, Frieza also has an ultimate move, which is Death Ball. So be very careful about uh, Frieza in uh, hyper mode. So let's uh, fight uh, Frieza and finish the story. Chi does not recover automatically. Watch your key gauge. So yeah, we gotta uh, uh, recharge our own uh, Chi or punch, I suppose. Oh, what the hell, man? Okay, okay. Okay, nice. He has way more health than me. Not good. Okay, I need to charge here. I need to transform too. I'm not doing much damage to... Oh, boy. Wow, oh, wow, wow, wow. That hurts. He's almost out though. Okay. Let's put him in Dragon Rush. I'm going to try and transform uh, after this Dragon Rush uh, sequence. 
Okay, I'm gonna copy Freezer's B. Hopefully he doesn't press the same button. Okay, good. What would you go for, X or Y? Oh, I have a feeling he's gonna go for X. Yes! Awesome. At least we've taken a full bar of health off him. Nice. Okay, I'm gonna use this chance to transform now. To transform. No. Sharp Bajax, not funny. <laughs> okay, he's st still got more health than me, man. What the hell? How did that happen? <laughs> I feel like Freezer got uh, got played then. That wasn't fair on Freezer. Okay, good. I can do a full pursuit because he has no cheer. Okay, the black uh, underwear that Freezer wears is... Uh, I don't suppose they're underwear, but very weird. <laughs> okay. Okay, whoa, 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 whoa. Freezer. Damn it. Okay, last bar, good. Whoa, what the hell? <laughs> cool. <laughs> oh my gosh, that was just by chance, of course. I would never be able to um, predict that. Okay, good, good. I have no chi left now, though. <laughs> uh. Oh, mommy. No, we've done it. We've done it. Awesome. Three levels we uh, leveled up by. <laughs> uh, okay, there we go. I, I gave it everything I had, and he's still not. Strange. This little brat shouldn't be capable of such a high power level. Dad. Gohan trembles before Frieza's terrifying power. Can Goku make it in time? Okay, so we have unlocked Team Gohan as a character now, which is awesome. So Shenron will give us the op what am I saying? Shenron will give us the chance to uh, uh, get any one of these. Never get the third option. It's a uh, miscellaneous like capsule, which is you can get by buying it in the skill shop, or you probably get in a random. Um, uh, capsule event so only focus on these two so breakthrough is um, a capsule that allows you to use all the abilities and powers of uh, whatever character you got the breakthrough capsule for and the memories of kid gohan is um, all the voice lines for kid gohan um, so you want to focus on these two because they're both capsules and you need all the capsules to 100% the game So uh, I'll just get breakthrough for Kid Gohan now and when I show you the second playthrough of Kid Gohan I'll I'll get the memories of Kid Gohan then uh, But get whatever you want just do not get the third option Very well. I understand. Okay can use all of Kid Gohan's moves and abilities this is in this includes transformations too Peace out, bro. I love seeing the Dragon Balls, uh, uh, you know, spread out like that. And this is the credits. It's a very long credit. Um, so I do want to just talk about something. This is the first um, video of this kind of like, I'm going to go through all the uh, Dragon Universes and 100% them. Um, the, the, you're probably wondering, why did you not do Goku first? Goku has a very long, uh, Goku has a very long, um, 
uh, dragon. Why did I not do Goku first? Because I have to do a first playthrough anyway. Um, yeah, I have to do a first playthrough anyway, and uh, I, I was I was thinking why do why why don't I just do everything? Um, why don't I do the stuff I need to do? Um, because yeah, why did I do Goku first? Just for the first playthrough. Because I was going to do Goku's first playthrough. And then I was going to do Dragon Universe with every single character. And then do Goku's second playthrough. Because um, there's a secret battle point in Goku's story. If you complete the game. Uh, complete the stories of every single character. Um, I, I think I just didn't want to do Goku. Because it's so long. I think I still got to do some research, research. And practice on his story mode. Uh, to memorize the locations of uh, certain items and stuff. Yeah, I think that was why I decided to do Kid Go Harm because it's nice and uh, you know compact, small story mode. Um, so I'm gonna show you. Uh, I think in the next video for this uh, series, if, if you want to call it a series, just uh, Dragon Ball Budokai Three story modes. I think I'll show you um, Kid Go Han's second playthrough. I don't know how I'm gonna structure that. Um, it, it, it won't be a 100% playthrough in the sense that I'll be showing you every single thing you can do in the second playthrough because a lot of it is repeat stuff from the first playthrough. So I think what I'll only do, I'll show you all the, just the new stuff you can get in the second playthrough. Um, I'll still have to do like, some first playthrough battles like fighting Nappa to end the Saiyan Saga and stuff. Um, but I think all the like new items, the new, bo uh, the new fights, I'll show them. Uh, but I won't do anything else from the first playthrough, like items or uh, story events. Um, so I don't know if I should label it 100%, but uh, I probably should. I don't know. I mean, if you do, if you follow along with the second playthrough of, of video, you'll have 100%ed everything in Kid Gohan's uh, Dragon uh, Universe. So maybe I should. I don't know. I don't, I don't suppose the title matters anyway. But I mean, do you want to see me do all the first playthrough stuff again on the second playthrough videos? Uh, because, you know, I've just showed you <laughs> the majority or all of the first playthrough stuff. So um, it's pointless just adding filler to the videos, you know. Uh, so I think I will just focus on the bonus stuff. There are some first playthrough stuff I got to do. Um, but I'll talk about it as I um, do it, you know. Um... So yeah, that is uh, the Dragon Universe. Very fun. I I really do love this style of uh, story mode where you fly around the uh, world of Dragon Ball and um, you know interact with just seeing small events. Even though they're just talking, I just I don't know. I just I just always really love this story mode. Uh, really good. So that's Goku fighting Oob. Awesome. And that is the end of Z credits. Such an awesome freaking game. I love it. Goodbye, Baba. Okay, everyone. That is it for Kid Gohan's Dragon Universe first playthrough. So thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. And I shall see you all in the next video. Farewell.